Hello and welcome back to the Trainers of the World Tournament. I'm your host, Delta TDS, and today for match number... Oh god, I forgot. I forgot. Uh... 143, we've got the Galar Champion Leon going up against the Sinnoh Gym Leader Crasher Wake. Leon is one of the seven trainers that has the perfect 6-0 record as Crasher Wake's one of the one of the three trainers that has the 4-2 record. Leon's got the Gigantamax Charizard, Crasher Wake's got the Mega Gyarados, and once these trainers are ready we can see who will be moving on to round 5. Leon starting off with the Mr. Rhyme as Crash Awake starts off with that Scizor. A pretty unique Pokemon for a water type team. Leon's gonna switch out to the uh, Rhyperior. Bull Punch is doing 50% to Rhyperior. I'm I'm sorry? Bull Punch takes out the Rhyperior. That's something I was not expecting. Leon's gonna send out that Charizard. And Crash Awake's gonna send out the Politoed, starting off the rain. G Max Wildfire is gonna do 13% to Politoed in this rain. Charizard with the max overgrowth is gonna do or take out that Politoed and start a grassy terrain now. Four turns in, and both trainers have lost one Pokemon. Crasher Wake's gonna send out that Gyarados. And Leon's gonna switch out that Charizard for that Aegislash as Gyarados goes for a Dragon Dance. Aegislash going for the King's Shield against Gyarados' Crunch, lowering that attack. Another Crunch takes. Aegislash nearly to half health, activating the weakness policy, and Shadow Ball does take out that Aegis er, that Gyarados. Crash Rick is going to send out that Floatzel now. As Aegislash goes for the King's Shield, Crunch is going to hit that shield, lowering the attack on Floatzel. Leon you know, switching out to the Rillabooms, setting up another grassy terrain. Leon you know, switching out to that Charizard. Ice Fang's doing a quarter to Charizard. And now it's just the grassy terrain up. Hurricane doing 92% to Floatzel. Crunch doing just over a quarter to Charizard. As Life Orb takes out the Floatzel. And Pressure Wake sends out that Suicune now. Hurricane is going to miss the Suicune. Scald is going to take out the Charizard. And Leon's going to send out the Rillaboom now. Crash Wake switching out to the Armaldo as. Rillaboom goes for the Leech Seed, and the Grassy Train does disappear. Leon switches out to the Aegislash. X Scissors is going to do less than 10% to it. Aegislash going for the Shadow Ball, doing 57% to Armaldo, as Knock Off does take out the Aegislash, making it 3v3 right now, as Leon sends out that uh, Dragapult. Dragondars is gonna take out the Armaldo, and a Crash Awake sends out the Suicune now. Leon switching out to the Mr. Rhyme. Ice Beam's gonna do 13% to it, as Suicune goes for a Calm Mind. Mr. Rhyme sets up a Psychic Terrain, and it switches out to the Rillaboom. Suicune setting up another Calm Mind. Grassy Glide is going to do two thirds to Suicune as Ice Beam takes out the Rillaboom. And 
Leon's gonna send out the Dragon Pulse. Dragon Darts is gonna do gonna take Suicune down to four percent. And Leon just has that Mr. Rhyme. We can go for the rest. He went all the way up. Dazzling Gleam is going to do 12% to Suicune. And Scald with the critical hit takes out the Mr. Rhyme. Which means Crash or Wake takes game number one. Uh, Leon's perfect record is now tarnished by the funny wrestler from Sinnoh. Uh, we didn't see anything from Politoed other than the Drizzle and the uh, Damp Rock. We saw the Life Orb from the Floatzel, the Chestoberry on Suicune, as well as Rest. Uh, we didn't see the Mega Gyarados that game, which was quite interesting. We saw Scizor 2 hit a uh, Rhyperior. We saw the Aegislash with the Weakness policy. And we saw the Rillaboom with Grassy Surge. Leftovers and Grassy Glide. But we are back on the field for game two, and we'll see if Leon can take this to a game number three. Leon, having started off with the right period, switches out to the Rillaboom as Skull does just over a quarter to Rillaboom and gets the burn on it as well. Very lucky burn for Crasher Wake. Switches out to the Scizor as Rillaboom goes for that Leech Seed. I'm not gonna try and keep up with all the healing from stuff. Leon switches out to the Aegislash as Scizor goes for a U turn, switching out to the Armaldo. Aegislash is gonna go for the King Shield as Armaldo goes for a knockoff. Lowering that attack on it, thanks to that King Shield. Going for a second King Shield. Lowering the attack again on Armaldo. Crasher Wake's gonna switch out to the Gyarados, intimidating the Aegislash. Return the Rain left. And Crash Wake's gonna Mega Evolve that Gyarados and set up a Dragon Dance as. Aegislash goes for a Shadow Ball, doing 20% to a Gyarados. Gyarados, the Jumbo Shrimp, is looking pretty terrifying right now, as it goes for a second Dragon Dance. Aqua Tail takes out that Rhyperior with one hit, and Leon sends back out that Rillaboom. That burn is going to be detrimental to his performance. Crunch is doing just under two thirds to Rillaboom as it goes for a Drain Punch doing 20%. So much healing and losing of health. Grassy Glide is going to do 35% to Gyarados. Crunch does finish off the Rillaboom. And Leon is down to four Pokemon left as he sends out that Aegislash now. King Shield. As Gyarados predicts it and goes for another Dragon Dance. Crunch takes out the Aegislash. Leon is sending out the Dragapult now. Crunch takes out the Dragapult. And he sends out the Mr. Rhyme. Crunch takes out the Mr. Rhyme. And it's all down to Leon's prized Charizard, Game Freak's favorite child. Gonna Dynamax. Rocketeer is still gonna take it out. And Crash Your Wake with a, a 6 and 0 oh against Leon takes game number two, which means he'll be moving on to round five where he'll be going up against the winner of tomorrow's match between Berg and Thornton. Thank you so much for watching, and until then, take care.